Did you know you can no longer order your Uber directly from the Google Maps app? Did you even know you could do that in the first place? Let's talk about it. Hey everybody, Mark here with uberhints.com and I saw all of these streams coming down on my feed. The same thing, I thought, this has got to be an important story. I was wrong. All it said was you can no longer order your Uber directly from the Google Maps app. And they said further, this is in Android, in iOS they stopped doing that a year ago. Is this even a story? Did you even know you could do it? I didn't know I could do that. So I wonder, does this really affect us in any way? I mean, I have been riding with Uber for years. I have never ordered the Uber directly from my Google Maps app. Why should I? I have an Uber rider app. What am I missing? But what information can you get about Uber from the Google Apps? No, Google Maps. Google Maps Apps. There we go. So I open up my Google Maps app and I set a destination on there. All right. I am going from um, Miller Park, that's uh, our baseball stadium in Milwaukee, to General Mitchell International Airport. Okay. So that, that's where I'm going. And it says here that will take 19 minutes by car. It will take an hour and a half by public transportation. All right, and um, that will be a bus. I'd have to walk 14 minutes to the bus to start with. It's going to take two hours and 44 minutes if I just hike the whole thing. And it's going to take 53 minutes if I ride a bicycle, I'm not kidding. That's all the information that tells me. And it will take me the same 19 minutes if I order a ride chair. And there's our ride chair. It's like a guy hailing a cab. You can see that one that's highlighted. So when I check that, what it tells me is from 19 to $26 to take an Uber X, 33 to $44 to take an Uber XL, 41 to $53 to take an Uber Select, 50 to $65 to take an Uber Black, 64 to $82 to take a black SUV. That's with Uber. So uh, the Uber X is 19 to 26. Through Lyft, ooh, Lyft is more expensive. 21 to 26. For Lyft Plus, it's 37 to 44. For Lyft Premier, it's 44 to $53. For Lyft Lux, it's 57 to 67. And for Lyft Lux SUV, it's 72 to 84. So on the high end, we're, yeah, we're off by about two or three dollars. But I, I don't know, I, I guess this is good information, but if I really wanted this, it's just as easy because look at the choice it gives me. I don't know if you can see that, but the choice it says is open in app. So it's not really that big a difference. I just hit that button and it automatically opens my Uber app anyway. So even though I can't order it direct, so I have to push one more button, is, is that really the big term? And now it's, it's set up already. You know, it, it took me right to the request. It said I can have one in five minutes. So it's just one more button I push. I can't order it directly, but it took me seven more seconds really is this news is that even news it still gives me the link it will still open my app in my phone sometimes i just don't get it and i want to ask you do you think that's going to influence our bottom line in the least how can it i'm still getting my information from the google maps i push a button i can still order my uh Uber or my Lyft. So in my mind, this was, a, they, it must have been a really slow Tuesday because as far as I'm seeing, this is a non-story. 
Now I know what you're thinking. Mark, why are you doing a story on a non-story? I guess I'm just as bad as uh, the mainstream media, right? I got sucked in. But I just want to share that with you. If you heard anything about it, um, bottom line is, I don't think it's going to affect us in the least. Yeah, what do you think? Am I wrong? Did you notice a difference a year ago when on the Android, they stopped allowing you to order direct from the Google Maps app? If you didn't notice a difference then, why should we notice a difference now? Well, that's all I've got for you. I'd love to hear your opinions down below as always. I love it when you like my videos, when you share the videos. And if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. And also visit the Average Me channel. It's really good. Thanks a lot, everyone. I'm Mark from uberhints.com.